Hello. Hello. How are you today? Doing good? Yes, very good. Excellent. Glad to hear that. Let me see here. We have volume. Very nice. We're just going to wait for a couple of your classmates so they can start working with us, okay? Okay. Who else is here? Only you, right? Did you watch the class from yesterday? No. <gasps> Why? Uh, mm -hmm. uh, um, uh, how come out? Mm. Okay. Okay, I think we're gonna start, uh, Francisco. Yesterday we actually worked with video conferencia number 18. Today is video conferencia numero 19 de la unidad 4 de modulo 6, beginners, right? So. Two of us in class. Ah? Huh? Two of us in class. Two of us, yes. <laughs> let me let me send them a message. Ayer viera que bien noche se conectaron. Ah. Sí, no vi el mensaje que les mandé. ¿Cómo no? A esa hora no había nadie. ¿Puede creer usted? Eran como las ocho, ocho. Las ocho, a los ocho y quince empezaron. Bueno. Exactly. <laughs>
la encuesta mañana la vamos a llenar. Sí, mañana. ¿Ya recibió el, 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 la invitación? Sí. Ayer creo que me cayó. ¿Cómo se dice zancudo? Mosquito. Mosquito. Como mosquito, pero así más fancy. Mosquito. Y <ríe> longer guess. Which one? Longer guess. How do you spell that? Put it on the chat. I want to see. Longer. Uh -huh. um, el chat, quiero ver. Me voy a morir de sed. I didn't bring water. Give me a moment. Right on the chat, I will okay. put, get some water, okay? Okay. I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. My water is very near. Okay, how do you spell it? Let me see. Okay. Ah, laugh. 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 Mm -hmm. Hello, Corina. Hello, teacher. Hello, Hello. Laugh is when you smile. When you smile. Ah. Uh -huh. He laughs a lot every day, right? Enjoy your meal, Corina. <laughs> Provecho. No. Enjoy your meal. No. <laughs> Disfrute, dele, dele, dele. Thank you. Okay. I think we're going to start here with the class. Yesterday, we were watching a video, right, about the simple past, right? We're going to start watching the video one more time, right? So we can have more information about it, right? That's what we're gonna do today. The first, the first activity is about a video using simple past, Juan Francisco. So we're going to pay okay. attention. Hello, hello, Alan. Now, the first thing that we need to do, yesterday you were supposed to create some conversations using or very similar to the video that you that you watched, right? That, that's what we're supposed to do today. So that's what we're gonna do uh, this time, right? We're going to watch the first three minutes of the video so you can remember right, the video and then we are going to create a conversation. Is that clear? Okay. Yes, okay, very good, very good. You can eat, you can drink your coffee, it's okay. But let's start. Let's start here. In Spanish, yo les voy a preguntar, no sienten eso lo raro, pero no lo sienten porque lo saben aquí. Let me see. Can you see my computer? Yes. Can you see the PowerPoint in light blue? Yes. Yes. Okay, very good. Now we're going to start here. And tell me, remember, we're just going to watch here. Right. Can you listen to this? Yes. Yes? Yes. 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 Okay, very good. Let's pay attention, right? So we can remember we are going to create a conversation based or very similar to what they do, right? So please turn off your mics, right? I'm going to turn off. You are in mute, teacher. Thank you, Melvin. Now, something happened with the video. Just give me a moment because we have a backup video. Okay. 
Give me a moment. What about now? Can you see it? What, what can you see on the, on the screen? Yeah, can you see yes. it? Okay, very good. The PowerPoint se congeló, it got frozen. So we're gonna start here. Let me uh, know if you can listen. Yes. Yes, yes. okay, sure. let's continue. Did you have a good weekend, Monica? Oh yeah, it was great. So what did you do? On Saturday, I went to the theater with my parents. What play did you see? I saw Cinderella, and it was an amazing show. What did you like the most? I liked the costumes and the songs. What about Sunday? Did you do anything special? I read a book in the morning. Then I did my homework, though I didn't feel like it. But I knew I had to. The weather was so beautiful and warm. So we went on a picnic in the park in the afternoon. We ate some sandwiches and drank some fresh orange juice. After lunch, we stood on the stream bank and fed the ducks. Then we took a nice stroll through the park. A moment later, it started to rain. So we ran as fast as we could. As soon as I got home, I took a hot bath. I enjoy spending time with my family. How about you? How was your weekend? Well, on Saturday, I went shopping with my mom. I needed a dress for my cousin's birthday party, so I traded many dresses. So did you finally find your right dress? Yeah, I did. I found the perfect dress for the party. So how was the party? It was great fun! There were lots of beautiful decorations in the room. The cake looked amazing! My cousin blew out the candles and cut the cake. We sang the birthday song. Then we played lots of games and I won many times. Where was the party held? It was held at a party center. How was the food? The food was delicious, but I ate too much and felt a little sick. And I also drank too much juice. So were you able to stay until the end of the party? Yes, I was, because I only started to feel sick at the end of the party. When I got home, my mom made me some tea, and I felt much better after drinking it. Anyway, I loved the party. It was awesome. Your, your mic is up. Can you hear me? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Thank you. Now, you watch the video one more time. Yesterday, you were working in pairs. Right. And did you complete the conversation yesterday? No, right? You were working. No. no. Yeah, okay. Now what we're gonna do right now is that we're going to create a conversation. Remember, the the girls are describing what happened to them during last weekend. Right? Last week. Very good. So right now you're going to think about the activities you did during last weekend. What did you do on Saturday? What did you do Saturday morning? What did you do in the afternoon? Right? What did you do Sunday morning, for example? Right? And then you are going to create a conversation with your classmate, always using the simple past. I'm going to give you, it's 8.13. I'm going to give you until 
20 to create a small conversation, okay? It doesn't have to be three minutes. It's a small conversation where you can share right with your classmates. Is that clear? Okay. Yes? yes? Okay. Yes. Questions and answers. You ask me, I ask you, hey, what did you do uh, last weekend? I did this. Where did you go? And then you can start asking questions, okay? Is that clear? Okay. Yes? Yes. Do you have questions? Yes, uh, yes I have a question. Yes. Uh, we we are gonna talk about the uh, the activities that our partner do or my activity. It's going to be a conversation, Edwin. For example, okay. uh, uh -huh. what did you do? What did you do last Monday? Uh, I went to the supermarket. Oh, uh, to which supermarket did you go? A super selectos. Why did you go to super selectos? Uh, because uh, I. I didn't have a, a vegetable, so I need to buy some ones. Oh, really? Some vegetables, yes. What kind of vegetables did you buy? Uh, potatoes, tomatoes, onions, uh, green papers, and, and that's it. That's it. Oh, perfect. Yes. Sounds delicious. Mm -hmm. And what kind of dinner did you prepare? What kind of food did you prepare with those vegetables? Uh, we, 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 we mix uh, these vegetables with eggs and some uh, uh, beef. So we made all this meat uh, for our dinner with my wife. And basically we have a good, uh, uh, we ate a good dinner uh, in the, the, this Monday. I mean, okay. last Monday. Last Monday. Mm -hmm. Very good. Okay. Right. That's what you're going okay. to do. Right, but what you can do also, right, is that you can ask me questions, for example, right? So it's, it's mm -hmm. like you answer, then you can ask me, and then we continue, right? Now, is right. it clear what we're doing? Yes? Yes. Yes, okay, very good. What about the others? Is it clear? Yes, yes? okay, so let's start. Yes. It's 8.15, we're gonna have 8.25 to finish the conversation, okay? Let's go. Okay. We're going to work in pairs. <clears throat> there will be only one group of three, and I'm going to send another person to that group. So let's start. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's create a conversation. Uy. Voy a hacer un cambio en un grupo después. Váyanse. Y ya les hago el cambio. Go, 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 go. Go. Select your group. Hello. I am going. I am going to change you. Okay. I'm going to split it to, with another people, with other people, because you were not in the class. Okay? Okay. Very good. I'm going to exchange you with group number one. Juan Francisco, bye. And then Edwin is going to work with you okay? We're in group number four. Okay. So I think can help you. No sé por qué no la encuesta, please. Hello, Edwin. Hi, Edwin. No. What Sorry. happened? I was. I changed you because Melvin and Francisco were together, and they didn't didn't come okay. to classes yesterday. <laughs> so they didn't know what to do. Okay. Okay. So you're going to help right. Melvin sure. to catch up with the activity, right? That's why you were moved. Sounds okay. Good. Perfect. I see you in a moment. No okay? problem. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank no you. problem. <laughs> Bye. Okay. Bye. Bye. For my family. For my family, and in the afternoon I saw the. No, I what don't. is a question that you can make when you say, I cooked for my family? What's a question that you can ask Maria in, in, in simple fast? 
What do you do for What do you cook? Hmm? What do you cook? What do you cook? What do you cook? Right? I need you to make conversations, not just to be like, uh, whatever. No. Okay. Make, make questions. Right? Make questions. Right? Okay. Juan Francisco, make questions. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um... Mm -hmm. What did you do in the in Saturday of morning? I uh, in Saturday in the morning, yes. I went to market mobile in the Ministerio of Agricultura. Where is that located? Santa Tecla. Hmm. Okay. What do you in buy the in parking, there? In, in the, the parking, in my car, uh -huh. I I don't know. Dar la vuelta. You go around. Uh, exactly. Very good. Uh -huh. You go around and you start buying the food. Yes. Oh, okay. Very good. Who is floor? Who is this floor? Okay. Okay. And what did you buy? I bought um, tomato, onions, papers. Paper is a chile, verdad? Peppers. Uh, peppers. Peppers. Different vegetables. Vegetables? Vegetables. Or you can say veggies. 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 Veggies, vegetables. And cream and cheese. Mm. Coffee. Cream, toast. cheese. Uh -huh. Toast. Toast. And um, beans. Uh huh. And. Um, Fish and fish, fish too. Only and the Onion. fruit, fruit, fruit. How do how do you say it? orange and fruit? Fruit. Oranges. Okay. Watermelon. Okay. Duraznos. How do you say durazno? Peaches. Peaches and bananas. Okay. What other question can you make to her, Osmi? Um, what did what did you cook uh, on weekend? During the weekend. Uh -huh. During the weekend uh, for your family. Very good. I cook the barbecue in the <gasps> in the lunch for the lunch, and the dinner I how do you say pedi? I give. I give I give a pizza. Ah, you ask for delivery. Yes. Mm -hmm. You say it like this. I ask for delivery. Hello, Carla Gabriel. I ask for delivery. Hello. Teacher. Yeah. Last night I stayed with Edwin and talked with Ed Edwin. Mm -hmm. And this moment Edwin is here in no more. Oh, the, th the thing is that he was with Juan, Juan Francisco and Melvin. Melvin and Juan Francisco were not here yesterday, so they don't know about the class, the simple class. Mm. So you are supposed to help him. No puedo dejar a dos personas que debieron vinieron a clase juntos. <laughs> English is a help. Yes, exactly. <laughs> exactly. Okay. Carla Gabriel, your camera, please. Osmin, what do you do um, Sunday in the morning? The Sunday in the morning, I went to the supermarket on Walmart. I I bought two two orals, um in the afternoon. Um, I make quesadillas uh, on my. You cook delicious. Delicious. <laughs> um, tia is called. How do you say tia? Aunt. 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 Okay. My. Mm -hmm. Um, Sunday. And. Uh, uh, when, um, 
a pescar, no sé, how do you say pescar? You went to fish. Suelo. Fish. Fish. <laughs> okay, and so and you went to fish, more, fish. You more. Fish, fish. Double fish. Afternoon. Uh, okay. Afternoon. Doctor <laughs> San Salvador. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> Return at home. <laughs> what else? Sandra Verónica. Sandra Verónica. Ah, ok. Es que como ya había participado yo, pero para que se. Sí, llámelo. Sí, para que escuche la tuya. <laughs> ok. On Saturday, mm -hmm. I. I get up early because I. You woke up early. Uh -huh. I woke up. I woke up early because mm -hmm. I study no I I was studying uh, Microsoft Excel oh. from from eight at eight to? I, eight at uh, to from eight a.m. to eleven a.m. from eight a.m. to From 11 a.m. Okay. Uh, at the afternoon, I watch TV with my family. Mm -hmm. In the evening, we eat pupusas. You? Oh, yes. yes. You ate pupusas. Eight. Eight. Eight, Eight pupusas. Mm -hmm. Uh, how do you say que hizo mi mamá? That my mom cook. That yeah. my mom cook. Uh -huh. Cook, ¿verdad? Cook. Por eso. Siempre. Uh -huh. Exactly. On, on Sunday in the morning, I has my final proof of Microsoft Excel. Uh -huh. In the after in um in the afternoon, we uh -huh went to the party of my nip. Uh -huh. Ya me acordé, Sandra, eso era nip. Okay. <laughs> ah. <laughs> de la hora. Uh -huh. But it's my cousin, is my nip. <laughs> okay. Um, any more? Okay. Anything else? Anything else. <laughs> okay, very good. So let's, yeah? okay. Okay. Yes, okay. yes, yes, yes. <laughs> so let's go right now and we're gonna go to let's go, let's go, let's go. Teacher, teacher, solo, how do you say eh, sobrino? Nip or sobrina o el mismo? Niece and nephew. Uh, nephew. My nephew and my niece. Ah uh, my, my she is my niece, he is my nephew. Uh, my nephew. <laughs> Let's go. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Hello, hello. Okay, so let's listen to some conversations that you have created. Mm -hmm. My God. Supposedly. <laughs> so, who wants to start? Hello, Esther. Hi, teacher. Who wants to start? Conversation. Okay, thank you, Corina and Sandra. <laughs> Corina, start, please. <laughs> Uh -huh. Hi, Corina. Hi. What did you do on weekend? Last weekend. I'm <clears throat> on Saturday. On um, Saturday morning, uh, we went to Chalatenango with my daughter, uh, where my out and in the uh, in the afternoon. I made quesadillas. Quesadillas. Very good. 
Uh -huh. um, in Sunday, I went to uh, the, how do you say, pescar? Ah, I told fish. you already. <laughs> fish, fish. 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 <laughs> in afternoon Sunday, I went to San Salvador. Okay, okay. From Chalatenango to San Salvador. From Chalatenango to San Salvador. Okay, very good. Get them an applause, very nice. Get them an applause, very okay. good. Remember Continue. that you need to exchange questions, okay? Who's, who's next, another another person? Corina, choose another partner. Okay, uh, Veronica. No, another one. Oh, uh -huh. um, Ellen, Alan? Alan, mm. Alan, who was your partner, Alan? Uh, Raul. Raúl, so let's listen to Raúl and Alan. No. Eh, Alan, eh. <laughs> no. Hey. <laughs> okay. Don't I, tell anybody, Raúl. What, what, what did you What did you What did you do the, the last Saturday? The last Saturday. Mm -hmm. Well, at at the morning, the last Saturday, I I had a. Uh, a uh, meeting uh online class mm -hmm. from from my university so i was on class uh, it start uh it started at seven and finished at ten okay and then with my wife and my daughter we ask questions Raul. Yes, I am. I am listening. Mm. Doug, <laughs> ask me. Ask, ask me another question, please. <laughs> where Where did you go with your family? Ah, uh, at the at the afternoon we we go. We went to the beach. Oh, the beach. Okay. Yeah. And did you did you did you eat? Something? I don't. Yes. <laughs> what did you take? <laughs> no. Uh, at the lunch time, we I eat turtle eggs. It's a crime, I know, but I eat it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm gonna call what nine one one right now. No, don't don't call to Politur oh, or oh, Salva Natura. Call the cops. No. <laughs> but but I eat I eat I eat it turtle legs. Y lo repite. <laughs> don't yeah. record the, the class. It is recorded. That's <laughs> proof. No. For the cops. In my face. I ate turtle legs. Ah, that's that's good. You too. Okay. <laughs> that's you. That's your conversation. Okay. Very good. Okay. That's a lie. I I embed all. This is an example conversation. Yeah, no. it's a it's a it's supposed to be. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay. Let's let, let's Cuidado, continue. Alan, no to... lo van a meter preso por comer huevo de tortuga. <laughs> Tres años después. Ya lo ven a Bartoli. Okay. Let's continue. Yeah, Maria. Hi, Miss. How are you? Alan, I am. No, it's Sam. it's a conversation. It's a supposed to be. It's not called. We buy it all. Marista's teacher no eat turtle eggs. Turtle eggs. No, <laughs> I watch only a few guys eating turtle mm. eggs. So I imagine that I <laughs> ate turtle eggs the side of the day at lunch. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, okay, let's see. Besides that crime, right, who else wants to no. participate? <laughs> Somebody else? Okay. Alan, choose another person. Ah, okay. Mini, many, many more. Can the tiger by the two? Maria de Jesus. Es venganza. 
No. <laughs> Thank you, teacher. I think. No, me, don't remember. <laughs> Uh -huh. Who's your partner, Maria? Uh, Juan Francisco, Osmin Alexander, Just and one. Carla Gabriel. Um, Osmin Alexander. Okay. Osmin <laughs> Alexander, what do you do? Uh, Saturday in the afternoon. The Saturday in the afternoon, I... I work and I I start I start I start at twelve mediodía middle day mm -hmm. uh, twelve twelve middle day to four p.m. Um, in the night, what do you do in the night? In the night, I watched. TV, uh, the movie, the scary movie, and I eat, eat I ate, I, I ate pupusas. Thanks. Very nice. It's a good Salvadorian people. Tell the truth. <laughs> <laughs> okay, only that? Only that. Give them an applause, give an applause to everyone. To Raul, to Alan, to Maria, very good. To Sandras, right? Give them an applause, very nice. Now we're yeah. going to continue working here. And I need you to look at, we're going to do, we're gonna keep working with simple pass, of course, until tomorrow, right? And can you see my computer? Yes. Yep. Okay, very nice. Now here on my computer, it says Ethan, is complaining about his housemate. Housemate is like a roommate, okay? He says they complete what he says. Now, the first sentence that you can see here on the computer, this first sentence is in simple present. Right? He eats my food, right? Now, this is the information about the housemate. He eats my food. So what we are going to do is that we are going to convert this sentence into the past tense, right? So if it says, he eats my food, we are going to use the same verb here, right? Eat, and we're going to put it here on, on this line, right? You say, last week, he all my cheese. So what can we put here as the verb? What is the past tense of eat? Eight. 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 Very nice. So what we're gonna do here is that we're gonna put e eight. Right. Let me see another color. He ate all my cheese. Right. That's what we're gonna do. And what would be in number two? The sentence says he does very little housework. Right. What is the verb in that sentence? What is the verb here? Das. Hmm? Das. Das. Very good. Das is the verb. Das is the verb. Can you tell me, please, right, what is the past tense of das? Did. Did. Very good. So the answer here is, last week, he did any. He didn't. He did. Didn't. He did any. Last week, he did any, right? So it means that he didn't do any other work, right? Right? Or we can, we can also put another answer for this specific question, right? He did not do anything. That will be like longer information, for example, right? That's another option, right? If we want to put like in the negative form, right? Last week he did any, right? Or last week he did not do anything. The word any is negative. So it tells us that this person is lazy, right? Now you are going to do exactly the same. You're going to put, you're going to identify the verb in the first sentence, right? And you're going to change that verb 
to the past in the other sentence. So it makes sense. Is that clear what we're doing? Yes, no, maybe. Is yes. it clear? Okay, now I need you to go ahead and take a screenshot of this, of this page so we can start working. Are we ready? Yes. Yes, okay, very <laughs> good. Let's get to work then, right? Remember to first do the work individually, right? And then you compare with your partner to see if you have the same answers, right? So not only one person starts working. First, do it individually, and then you do it, you compare, okay? So let's start. We're gonna work in groups of three. Right. Teacher, sorry, my screenshot salió <laughs> movida. Can you pull again your screen? Please. Give me a moment. Can you see now? Yes. Yes. Okay, ready. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. You want to raise all. Ya no pudimos copiar a la nuestra. Let's start working here. And let's see. Yeah. Let's get together. Let's get together. We're going to work in pairs. There is only one group of three, right? Let's get together right now so we can practice. Alan, wake up. I'm wake up. <coughs> I'm up. <laughs> Very good. Select your groups. Select your groups. Select your groups. Select your groups. Carla, select your group. Maria. Esther. Juan, Corina, select your groups. Carla Gabriel, select your group. Uh, you have the number three. Number three, uh, I think it's a snore. Snore, but uh -huh. I don't know what does mean snore. Como... <sighs> that is a snore. When you're sleeping, sometimes, for example, in my case, when I'm sleeping, I make noises with my nose. Like right? those, th those are very. Um, very bad noises that you make with your noise, with your with your nose. Those are uh, those are uh, when you snore. Okay. I will show. But I will show you. This is a, a regular bird. Huh? This is a irregular bird. I don't know. You tell me. What do you no, think? No, it's it's regular. regular. This is snort. It's snort. Snort. Oh, this is Google. You change the, the S or the D? D, yeah. Okay. Thanks. I think. <laughs> Look at the snore. Snore. This is a snore. Ah. Ah. Feliz una seña. Exactly. Yes, but, but I think, I thought it was uh, like, is, like a chew. No. Yeah. <laughs> it's the sound that you make when you're sleeping, mm -hmm. right? That's a snore. Now, if we want to know if a very sim is regular or irregular, we just go here, a snore, regular, regular verb. Look at this, regular or irregular, right? And then we go with the English page, not the first one. Right, and then we can see here. Right, it's north. We see that is in regular verb. Right. Right. Okay. Very good. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Hello, Ellington. 
Hi, Alinton. Hi, Alinton. How are you? How are you? Doing good. Thank Very you for good. asking. Good. Thank you. We have to change the read the whole sentence and change the word in the past. Uh, he borrow borrow it. <laughs> borrow 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 he goes the past went number five is went went but read the sentence. No, don't only translate the, the verb, don't only change the verb, but understand what the sentence means. What is the meaning of the sentence? Do you understand what it means? Yes. He goes out a lot. Last week he went out. Necesito que no solamente lo pongan en pasado, sino que entiendan la oración, okay? okay. That's very important. Okay. Questions? I'm going to translate. Right now, no. Okay. See you when I see you. Bye. Okay. Bye. 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 Do you have questions? I see you very quiet. <laughs> For in only person. Ah, uh, individually. Yeah. Individual. Yes. Individually. Okay, good. I am full, so I'm gonna put this. My daughter say, Mommy, I call. <laughs> <laughs> and me. I finish. Okay. okay. And you, Sandra? Did you finish, yeah. Sandra? Yeah, yeah, yes, ready. Number three. Number three is he snores. It's okay, snores, teacher. Snored. Snored. What? Snored. Snore. Mm -hmm. He snored. Last Sunday he snored. Mm -hmm. All night. Night. All night. Okay, very good. Number, Number four, he always borrows my money. Last Monday, last month, he borrowed with over $300. Okay. okay. Number five, he, he goes out a lot last weekend. He went out very heavily. Number six, and he always forget his case. Last week he forgot his case four times. Number seven, he leaves the living room in a terrible mess. Yesterday he left all his stuff on the floor. Number eight. He plays low music a lot. Yesterday, he played low music all day. We can hear you, teacher. Is that it? That's it? Right? Okay, very good. We're going to go back so we can share all the answers, okay? Okay. Let's continue. Let's go, let's go. Hi. Hi. Okay, so let's share the answers because we have a lot of exercise to do today. What? 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 Okay, let's see here the answers for number three. Gabriel. 
he last Sunday he snored all night. Last Sunday he snored all night. Very good. Choose the next person. Um, uh, Esther. Esther. Sorry, number two. He does very la little. Number four. He always borrows my money. Last month, he borrowed over $300. He borrowed? He borrowed over $300. Okay, very good. Who's next, Esther? Mm, Carla Gabriel. Carla Gabriel. No, Carla Gabriel just passed, another person. Another quick, another? Sí, Carla Gabriel escogió usted. Ajá. No se vale uno mismo. Uh-huh. <laughs> Esther, who's next? Let me see. <laughs> Was me. Okay. No estoy. No vino. What number? Number next. Pay attention, guys. Pay attention. Um, number four. five. No, five. He went out a lot last week. Uh, he... Uh -huh. He he went out every every evening. Every evening, okay, very good. Last week he went out every evening. Very nice. Who's next is me? The next is uh, Raúl. Raúl. Hi. Francisco. Number, number six. And he always forgets his keys. His keys. His keys. Okay. Keys. Mm -hmm. Last week he forgot his keys for time. Very good. Very good. Last week he forgot his key for time. His key for time. Who's next? Uh, Esther Maricela. No, she already passed. Another Ay, person. Es la única que miro en mi, en mi pantalla. Espera. Yo la tengo ahí. <laughs> <laughs> Ellington. <laughs> Ellington, number seven. Welcome. Hello. <laughs> okay, he leaves the living room in a terrible mess. Yesterday he... Un moment. Yesterday he filled all his uh, stuff on the floor. What is the verb? Oh, yeah. Moment. What is the past tense of leaves? No se lo están escribiendo en el chat. Oh. <laughs> leaves is um. Leaves. No. Who wants to help Ellington? What is the past mm. tense of leave? Left. 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 Ellington? Left. 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 Eso dije. <laughs> Left. Left. L-E-L-T. -E like right and left. Right, left. Uh -huh. left. A kind of. Yes. Very good. Who's okay. next? Um, okay. Um, uh -huh. Edwin. Edwin. Present. <laughs> Almost. Uh <-huh. laughs> okay. Yesterday he played la loud music all day. Yesterday he played loud music all day. Very nice. Very nice. So, 
Do you have a question about this exercise? Please. Anybody? No. no questions? No questions. Okay, so we're going to continue. We're going to do also some other activities, some other exercises, but first, let me uh, take the attendance so we can continue, okay? I already stay present. <laughs> but you're the last one, so no. <laughs> Esther Maricela Orellana Maradiaga. I'm here. Raúl Francisco Márquez Argueta. Raúl Present. Francisco. Sandra Present. Verónica Herrera Vanegas. Present. Ada Lilian Hernández de Salmerón. Osmin Alexander Hernández Campos. Present. Ellington Antonio Fuentes Reyes. Present. Uh, Maria de Jesus Cardona de Fuentes. I'm here. Alan Javier Don Rivera. Present. Give me a moment. Fatima Giselle Valladares Parada. Zulma Patricia de Nicolato. Uh, Juan Francisco Ayala Montano. Present. Carla Gabriel Flores Pineda. Carla Gabriel. Present. Edwin Alexander Ayala Erazo. Present. Here. Ok. Sandra Corina Miranda Maya. Present. Ok. Melvin Alexander Serrano Mercado. Present. Very nice. So we have all of you here. Right. And uh, just we're going to do something in Spanish right now. Give me a moment. Uh, hoy, entre ayer y hoy, ya les estuvieron enviando a ustedes, a cada uno, la información de la agenda, de la agenda, perdón, de la encuesta, ¿correcto? ¿Ya la recibieron? Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. yes. ok, perfecto, me parece excelente. Como yes. ya la recibieron, por favor, recuérdense que la vamos a llenar mañana a las 9 de la noche, todos juntitos, mm -hmm. por si tienen alguna pregunta, porque todos tienen que enviar un screenshot. ¿Verdad? Que tiene que, eh, bueno, va a tener toda la información de los datos del curso y usted solamente ahí lo vamos a ir guiando para que tome la encuesta. ¿Ok? Entonces, sí, si ya la, yes. si no la, sí, dígame. Ajá. I send the screenshot. Oh. Ya lo envié. El viernes no. le dije yo. Viernes. ¿Por qué la envié ya? Pucha, con Gabriel. Yes. No, hoy enviémoslo todo. Es que me mandaron un correo que, que ahora era el último día. Dice? Se afligió, se afligió. ¿28 o no es 28? Ah, Oye, 27, no. 27. Oh, no. Me equivoqué yo. Mal de yo, la entonces. pandemia, eso es un mal de la pandemia. Ahí se me dice. Ahí se me dice. Ahí se me dice. Pensé que era 28. Ellington, tú. Ya me voy, me voy. I am. No. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. ¿Quién más le envió? Edwin. Me, teacher. Ah, Melvin. Yeah. No, I didn't send it. Ah, ok, ok. Elito. Elito. Elito, todavía lo dije a las nueve que usted ya estaba aquí, fíjate. Alan. No, no, no. It's a joke, it's a joke. A saber si le enviaron más. Lectura comprensiva, porque ahí dice que hasta el día Regáñelo, mi, regáñelo. Sí, así dice en el correo. Deberán llenar con su teacher, dice. Deberán llenarlo con la teacher, así dice. Vaya, ahora mándalo al módulo 3. La cual se llenará en conjunto con su facilitador. Exacto, ahí dice. Durante su última sesión de clases del módulo, por lo que no leyeron. ¿no? Póngale Vamos cero. Hacer... Pensé que la última sesión. <risa> Gabriel, defiéndese. No, mentira. Déjale. Yo pensé que era 28. Al menos 8, que le ponga para pasar. ¿Qué hacemos, Esther? En este caso, usted que es abogada, ¿qué me aconseja? Venga, llévela. Llévela ahí al Isidro Menel. A ella y a Melvin también. Y a Ellen. Okay. Es es más, hoy un rosario vamos a hacerme. <risa> Por ello. Ya ni eso, ya no le Es un buen acuerdo que un mal juicio, Tita. O sea que sí. 
no les cala. Ha dicho, caso cerrado. Una preguntita, ¿guardaron no, el okay. screenshot que decía gracias por llenar la encuesta? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Yes. ¿No lo han enviado, vea? No, no. Ya, no la Carla ya lo envió. Miren no, la no, Carla. Ya le vio la Carla. Sí, 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 les juro que pensé que era 28. <risa> Pero verdad que yo les dije el lunes que el viernes le íbamos a llenar. Es correcto. Sí. Por... Así, ah, Guárdese. Mire, el... Pero puedo eliminar el mensaje en WhatsApp. Sí, yo no, 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 no lo elimino. <ríe> ya, est oh, ya estuvo, <ríe> se nos va a decir fraude. Guárdelo, el Linton Antonio, por favor. No vaya a ser el diablo. <ríe> Guárdelo. <ríe> ok. Google Sorry. continue. Please don't fill out the forms anymore. We're going to do that tomorrow. A las nueve. En lo que todos los demás están llenando una, una, una la encuesta, Carla, Gabriel, Melvin y Elin van a estar haciendo un ejercicio que ellos van a presentar después. No se preocupen. Okay. De castigo. In small conversations, so don't worry. Una presentación en pasado van a hacer. A, nos van a explicar cómo llenaron la forma ellos solitos. In past yes. Okay. Okay. Qué bonito. Qué bonito, exacto. <laughs> ok, so let's continue. Si puedes, let's continue. Ay, ay, ay. Well, we have this. Can you see my computer? <laughs> yes. 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 Wonderful. Yes. Now, in this case, it says here, Marta lived in Spain for a year, right? And then it says, complete the questions for her answers. The first question is, I went in August. That's, the, that's the, the first question, sorry. The first answer. This is the answer. I went in August. Now, the question, it starts with when, when right? Now, yes. if it's when, what are we trying to ask? Are we trying to ask for people, for place? What are we trying to ask? For a date. For a date, for time. time. Very time. good. <clears throat> For time, we're trying to ask for time, right? Very good. Since we're trying to ask for time, right? And it says here, I went in August. The answer is correct. What could be a question that you can make in past? When did you go? Perfect, Raul Francisco. Give him an applause. Very nice. When mm -hmm. did you go? That is the answer that we need right here, right? It will be when, sorry, did you go? Very easy, like that, right? That will be, when did you go? I went in August, right? And then I need you to pay attention to all the answers so you can make the questions. In number three, we don't have anything, right? So let's see what you're going to write. Number six, we don't have anything, right? So if I am asking where, what am I trying to ask, uh, Maria? Where? Is it time? It's a place. It's for place. Very good. What about it's how? Mm -hmm. And how, Melvin? Um, mm -hmm. How do you do you? Find? No. What What are we trying to ask? Time, place, people. Um, what What are we trying to ask? If it's how. Um, as I don't know, I start to, I don't know. Kind of, kind of, yes. No, kind of. Mm -hmm. We're trying to ask when we're trying to ask here for where, what we're trying to ask is place, right? How is manner, None. manner or state? And what about who, Carla Gabriel? Uh, person. Persons, okay, persons or people, right? That's what we're trying to ask there. Very good. Now, do we understand what we're going to do right now? So-so. So-so? What is your question, Juan Francisco? <coughs> Poder hacerlas. <laughs> That's what we're going to do. Don't worry if you make mistakes, okay? I will be with you in a, in a minute in your group. We're going to work here. We have one, two, three, four, five, six. We have three people. We're gonna make right now three groups. Oh no, this is the shine. Okay, we're gonna make three groups right now, right? So we can work uh, together. Let's see, oops, sorry. 
Okay, let's start. We're going to work right now. Did you take a screenshot of this exercise? Yeah. Yes? Wait, 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 wait. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah. <laughs> okay, ready? Ready? Wait, wait, wait. Yeah. ready? Yes. 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 Wonderful. Let's go ahead. Let's get to work right now. Remember, look at the answers. Look at the answers so you can make the question. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's get to work. Let us go. Sandra Corina. Let's go. Corina. Hello. Corina, Corina. Corina, cuando tenga internet, se va para su grupo, por favor. No, pero, pero mi, mi esposa, gracias a Dios, cuida todo. Mm, very good. Mm -hmm. You have a, a good wife. A good wife, yes. Yeah. Yeah. She really takes care of okay. my daughters very well. No, nice. Uh, mm -hmm. And take care to you. <laughs> you too. Mm. <laughs> or <right>. no, yes. <laughs> También a usted lo cuida, le digo. Ah, sí, sí, también hasta mí. Es nuestro don. But sometimes, no, always. Ya lo oyó, ¿verdad, esposa? No, I just play. I just play. All right, uh, let's get back to the, the exercise. Um, let's practice it. Let's see. Number let's find two. Out. Number three or two? No, two. Es where, where did you live? I where live in Barcelona. Yes. Es, where did you live? Where do you live exactly? Where, where do you, you live? live? Questions about the exercise? No. Um, uh, what? Do you have questions about the exercise? For this mm -hmm. moment, no, not teaching. Not <laughs> no. Okay, I'll see you in a moment, okay? Okay. okay. okay thank you. Uh, You're welcome. Number three. Number three. Hello. Um, I don't know. How did you find? No. Number four. I found it through a friend. But how can you make the, uh, the, the question? Um, how, how, how did you find? No. I don't know. You discuss it. Let me see. Corina, what do you think? Oh. Juan, what do you think? I saw in the reference. It's on the fridge. Number four. Question. Yeah. Oh. What do you think? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Number four. Well, how did you find? 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 How did you find? How did you find? Uh huh. Mm -hmm. how, did you, how did you find? How did you? Number number five. Number five. <coughs> Who? I, oh, Mm -hmm. who, 
who did you think? Who did you teach? Who did you teach? Okay. Oh, yes. I taught groups of teenagers. Very good. That's great, Francisco. Very nice. Who did you teach? Okay. Number six. Number six. Oh, what means taught? Enseñar, creo. No, enseñar que no es teach. Oh. Yes, but that is in present. And you're talking in the past. Go, and go, go to Google and look for past tense of teach. Okay. Uh -huh. What did you... How, how did you teach? What did you teach? How did you teach? How? But it says who? Oh, I who did you teach? Teach. <laughs> teach. I who teach. did you teach? Mm -hmm. I taught. Who did you teach? I taught. I taught groups of teenagers. Teen... Teenagers. Teenager. Teenager. Very good. How do you Okay. And the last six. No, no it wasn't. Well, pay. Well, pay. No, it wasn't well paid. Yes, paid. No, it wasn't. No, it wasn't well paid. Ah, uh -huh. can I? It's not a good pay. Well paid. For example, let's suppose. Uh, last last time I told you, Raúl, that Aldeas Infantiles was paying. Uh, $300, right? For <laughs> teachers, right? So I say, mm, that is not well paid. Not well paid. Uh -huh, not well paid. So what is the meaning of well paid? Well that job paid. is not well paid. But if, yeah. for example, if I say, oh, I work in a big company, I get $1,000 a month. That is that is well paid. Well paid. Uh -huh. So what is the meaning of well paid? El, pues el, el pago. Exactly. El pago. Very good. So what is the question here? What is the verb in that sentence? Uh -huh. It wasn't well paid. What is the verb? Did you have a well paid? No. Look at the sentence. It wasn't well paid. Was me and Ellington, what is the verb? Did you work? No. What is the verb in that sentence? It was, wasn't well paid. Wasn't. Uh, Very good. Wasn't. wasn't. Very good. So we're going to take the verb was and we're going to put it here in the question. Okay. Now what is the subject? Uh, huh? it, it, the subject. It. It. Okay. So it, what is the question? It, it was. It did was. No, 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 no. Well paid. Can you please write here what was the right. first thing? Was. Oh, sorry, sorry. Mm -hmm. Was. What did teniendo? you well pay? <laughs> was. was. Subject. It. Uh huh. Now complement. Was it well, well paid? paid? Was it well paid? No, it wasn't well paid. No, it wasn't well paid. Ah, you see? No, it wasn't well paid. That's, there you have a question. Okay. First, you identify the elements of the sentence and then you create the question. Right? Okay, very good. Remember that city, since it is was or where, we don't use did. Right? We don't use did. Okay. Let's go. Let's go with the others. I think the others finished. Ya habían terminado, vamos a poner.
Hello, Elinto. Hello, teacher. <laughs> okay, so let's share here. Where are the others? When the people. Okay. Oh, we have five people, six people. Who else? Let's wait for the others. Remember, the first question is, when did you go? I went in August. What would be the second, the second question and the answer? Let's start with, uh, yeah, you, Ellington. What would be the, the second one? Where did you live? Where, right, where? Where did you live? Okay, where did you live? Sorry, I'm gonna put here in red. I'm gonna put all the questions right here. Where did you, did you live? Very good. I, I lived in Barcelona. I lived in Barcelona. Very good. Let's see the number three, Veronica. Okay. Did you work? Yes. I got a job as an English teach. Did you work? Okay, that is an acceptable answer. Okay, a question. Did you work? Yes, I got a job yes. as an English teacher. Very good. What's another possibility for this? For number for number three, who has do something work? different? Do you work? Did you work? Did you work? But this is it's the same. Did you work? Did you work? No, another one. He one. He one. Did you get a job? Did you get a job? Did you get a job? Mm. Yes, I got a job as an English teacher. Very good. Those are two different and questions, but they are they make sense. Okay. Will sure. be for number yes. Did you get a new job? Yes, I got a job as an English teacher. Very good. Very good. Did you get a new job? Very nice. Very nice. That would be another another option. Very good. What about number four? Uh, Alan? Alan? Sorry, my mic is off. Uh, how did you find it? How did you find it? How did you find it? I found it through a friend. Very good. I found it through a friend. Very good. Esther? Tell me, teacher. What's the answer? Number five. Our question. Number five. I, yes. The I saw groups of teenagers. Okay. What's the question? Who did you teach? Who? Very good. Who did you teach? Who did you teach? I taught a group of teenagers. Very good, Esther. Carla Gabriel? What did you a good well? A good pay. Was it? A good pay. A good pay. Was it a good pay? Okay. No, it wasn't well paid. Very good. The phrase, this phrase, well paid, is already done. So we are not going to change it, okay? We're going to keep like well paid, okay? okay. Was, it, was it well paid? Was it well paid? No, it wasn't well paid. Okay, very good. Now, do we have the same answers, everyone? Do you have the same? Yes. Yeah. Yes? Yes. I don't do finish you... the last one. Okay, yeah. why? I finish the last one. 
Okay, yeah. I explained to you what's going on with the last one. Now, with the last one, what we need to do, right, is that we are going to identify, right, the oh. elements of, give me a moment. Oh, the elements here of the uh, sentence, right? What are the elements of the sentence, right? It wasn't well paid. Which one what? is, what is the verb in that sentence? It wasn't what? well paid. Was. Paid. Wasn't. Right? Was. Mm -hmm. Okay, verb, was. right, is was not. Okay, what is the subject? It. It, okay, subject is it, very good. And tell me what is the complement? Well paid. Well, well paid. paid. Very good. Well paid is the complement. Very good. Now, what we do here, as we know already, we have these elements of the sentence. This is the verb B, right? What is the formula to create questions with the verb B? Melvin? Maria told us on, on Monday, I think. Mm -hmm. What is it? What is the formula, Melvin, to create question, uh, questions for the verb B? For the subject. Okay, first this. The first, the subject for questions. Are you sure? Mm. For questions with the verb be. First, the verb The verb. First, the verb plus the subject so plus complement. And the question mark. There so, what? Sorry? Okay, so that will be the formula, right, for you to create the questions using the verb B. We're going to see some exercises right now since some of you had questions about the verb B in past. Okay, so don't worry. I need you to, to take a look at the answers. Do you have different answers? Or do you have the same? Hello, someone there? The same, I have the same answer. The same. have the same answers okay very good now let's go ahead and continue working let's continue i'm gonna start sharing here we're going to do exercises with the verb b okay okay oh well let's do this one very quick uh, let's see, no, look at this, 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 we're going to do this right now, together, all of us together. So we're going to help each other. The first one says, where did you go this weekend, right? And we're going to use what we have here on the, neck, on, on, on the side. Here we have to a party, right? This is what we're going to use. And let's pay attention to the question. Where do you go to this weekend? Right, this is matching this, right? I went to a party, right? Now, if I want to make a question with number two, it says someone very interesting, right? My question is, um, Raul, who did you meet at the party? What would be the possible answer that we can make? I, I meet. Meet in past, what is the past tense of meet? Uh, met. Met, very good. I met. I met someone very interesting. I met someone very interesting. Very good, very good. Look at the answer here that he's giving us. I met someone very interesting. Raul, uh, Juan Francisco. Number three, look at the question. It says, 
What time did you and Eva get home? You have a little after one. Um, what time did you, did you and Eva, Eva get home? Eva went a little after one. What time did you and Eva get home? What do you think the subject for this answer will be? If I'm asking you. And you say, what time you and Esther get home? For example. 1 p.m. No, what is the answer? What would be the subject for this sentence, for this answer? We. We. Very good. Um, we. Mm -hmm. We. What is the verb that we're using? Get. Get. Okay, what is the past tense of get? Juan Francisco? No, got. Uh, we got okay. a little after one. We got where? We got home. We got home. A little after one. Okay, very good. Maria, number four. How did you and Bob like the art exhibition? We we like mm -hmm. we like like the uh, a lot the art exhibition. We like the art exhibition a lot. A lot. Ah. <laughs> okay. Very good. Let's continue. Veronica, what did you buy? I bought the new Madonna CD. Very good. I bought the new Madonna CD. Very good. Now, the last one, Edwin. Where did Jeff and Joyce spend their vacation? Where did Jeff and Joyce spend their vacation? Uh, they spent the vacations in the country. They spent their mm -hmm. vacation in their the country. in the country in the country in the country very good the country is for, for example when you go to Ataco, Guayua that's the country they spent Atimaco. their vacation in the country okay very good do we understand the type of questions that we're making right now do you have yes. a question Yes? No, I understand. <laughs> okay, very good. Anybody, questions right now, please? Let me know. No, Hello? it's understandable. It's understandable, okay, very good. Let's continue then. If you don't have questions, let's continue. We're going to work right now. No, we're gonna do this later. Look at this. Let's practice a little bit of uh how do we call this as simple past right still but we're going to use the verb be so look at the question it says where were these people born that's the question where were these people born so my question is where was barack obama born he born he he born he was he born he was born he was born okay. he was born mm -hmm. he was born. in cuba in cuba he was born in cuba in hawaii in no, cuba in hawaii cuba he was he was cuba. born in hawaii okay very good uh, hawaii that's Sorry. one <laughs> he was born <laughs> in hawaii okay barack obama was born in Hawaii. Okay. What about Gloria Stefan? Where was she born? 
Where uh, was she born? born Gloria, Gloria Stefan was born in Cuba. 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 Gloria, okay. Gloria, Gloria was born uh, in Cuba. Gloria was born in Cuba. Very Como nice. Los que en Cuba. <laughs> <laughs> now, what about Albert oh. Einstein? German. Einstein was born in Germany. Very good. Germany. Born. Germany. And we go with the last one. You say born. Was born in Jamaica. 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 Very good. Gold was Born in Jamaica. Very good. Very good. This is the first exercise, right? We are using here the verb be, right, to say something about where people was born, for example, right? To, to say nationalities, right? Where the people were born, right? So that's one use of the verb be. Is that part clear? Yes? Yes. Okay. Yes. Very good. Very good. Remember, all of them are subject he or she. That's why we're using only was, 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 right? Okay. Okay, very good. Okay. Let's continue. We're working with the verb be right now. Here, we have past tense of verb be. Look at this, right? We have here when we are using I, we use was. Right? We use was. When we're using you, sorry. When we're using you, we use where. She was. Then we were, they were. All of this, they can also go to the negative form. Right? The negative form, right? Is we have I wasn't, you weren't. She wasn't, we weren't, they weren't. That would be the negative form. Right? This is positive, right? And the other one is negative. Look at the way we create questions, right? In this case, we always put the verb be at the beginning to make a question. Look at this. Then we have, how do you call this? Subject. Subject, very good. Then we have the subject, and then we have the complement. Yeah. Right? Very good. Were you in class yesterday, Gabriel? Mm -hmm. Yes, teacher. I was in class. Yes, I yes. was. Okay, very good. Yes, I was, or yes, I was in class yesterday. Very good. And that will be the same way we're going to create the questions right here in the negative or positive short answers, right? That's what we're gonna do. Remember that when we say wasn't, weren't, that is the, you know, the contracted form of was not and were not, right? Were not. It was not or were not. If you say were. I was not born in the UK, is that correct? Yes, it is correct, right? Both answers are perfect. So in this case, we should not have any issue, right? Okay, do you have a question about this? Not sure. No? Are you sure? Yes. yes. No? <laughs> okay, let's continue. Let's continue. Yeah, I have a question. Yes. Okay, go ahead. And, and he, he is was. He is also was, right? Oh. We have he... She and it is going to be was. Very good. Okay. Very nice question. Another question? No. No? No. Okay. Look at, look at the uses here. I want you to look at the uses of the past tense of the verb be. Right? We're going to pay attention here. Look at the examples. Right? What am I trying to say here? Born the, here. The, okay, the place where I was born, right? Yeah. What are these? You were pretty young. These are adjectives, 
right? Mm -hmm. To tell my age or to talk about my age, you are going to use the verb be. Right? Mm -hmm. To talk about a place. Okay. Give me a moment. To talk about a place in which you were in the past, you can use the verb be. We were at the hair salon. Uh, Gabrielle was in her house taking the class yesterday, right? Look at this. We talk about places. You're going to use the verb be in past when you're talking about places, age, adjectives. For example, I was happy. I was angry, right? I was hungry, right? So that's when you're going to use the verb be. These are like the use of the verb be, right? Is this part clear? Yeah. Yes, okay. Now let's continue. We're going to do one more exercise. <laughs> Let me know if you have questions, please. Let me know. Now. We're going to do here another exercise using the verb P. Can you see my computer? Yes. Okay, very nice. Now look at here what it says. What we're going to do is that we are going to match, right? One of the phrases that we have on the box, right? We have this. You know, we have this box, right? So one of the phrases from there is going to go to the answers here, but you, you need to like match the question with the answer. For example, Melissa says, were you born here in the US, Luis? No, I wasn't. I was born in the Caribbean, right? Then Melissa asks, oh, were you born in Cuba? We already used this answer, right? So it's not good. What is another answer that we can use? Mm -hmm. Oh, were you born in Cuba? Because Cuba is in the Caribbean, right? No, I'm from the Dominican Republic. No, I'm from the Dominican Republic. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe, right? Maybe. So what we're going to do is to try, you know, to match these different responses to the answers or to the questions that we have there. But I need you to read the question so you can have an answer. Is that clear? Yes. Yes? Okay. Only for Veronica, what about the others? Is it clear? Yes, yes. Yes, yes? No, no? Okay. Yeah. Very good. Let's let's take a screenshot here, please, of this activity. Give me one moment here. The, the, the information goes up to here. Was it scary? Okay. Do you take the screenshot? Yeah. yeah. Okay, very nice. Now we're going to work in pairs. We're gonna do this. No, let's do it in groups of three so it's easier for you. It's gonna be faster, right? <clears throat> okay. Let's get together right now. Let's get together. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Sandra Corina, let's go. I think that it's no I I I will be back, okay? Give me a minute. Okay. Okay. Cool. Well, I'm going to share the screen. Okay. 
I think is the last I was born in Santo Domingo. Where'd you born at home? Mm, mm, mm. Mm, yeah. Or, or no. Uh, where is it in negative? Well, see. Yeah, yeah. Santo Domingo is the city. It's the city, yes. Mm -hmm. mm. Entonces, the, is... I'm from Dominic. I'm from the Dominican Republic. Okay. Miren a Raúl, como que es la teacher, Van Berix. No, para ir llenando ya. No. Que siempre no. nos dice con Raúl. Entonces. Es que así no, así no me duermo. Votemos no. para Raúl. ¿Verdad, Carla? Yes. Después se lo tomamos otra vez la screenshot y listo. Ah. Todo eso vamos a seguir nosotras con las otras entonces, Carla. No, I'm from the Republic Dominica. What city, really? what what city were you born? Were you born? Mm -hmm. I, I was born I in was San, born Domingo. San Domingo. Eso me acuerdo de una canción de la Lady Gaga. <laughs> Y dice, I was born this way. You, baby, I was born this way. ¿Qué le pasa? El café. Estamos celebrando que Raúl no se durmió hoy. Oh, yeah, that is a good celebration. Because I drink a lot of coffee. Uh -huh. Ok, next. Where do uh, parents born in Santo Domingo too? Where do parents born in Santo Domingo too? Yes, they were. We were okay. all born there. Yeah, very good. Okay. Yes. The Dominican. No, no. Republic. I was. No, I weren't. I I am from the Dominican Republic. Uh huh. No, I weren't. No, I weren't, right? Is that correct? No, I don't know. No, I wasn't. <laughs> no, I wasn't. No, I wasn't. Very good. No, I, no, wasn't. I wasn't. I, I weren't exactly. doesn't exist. <laughs> no, I wasn't. Okay. I, uh -huh. I, I, I born, I am from the Dominican Republic. We, we, we could finish with that sentence right okay i don't so, know no i am i am asking to you <laughs> no you don't know i don't know no, no really okay i'm so, waiting to see your answers okay sino que chiste que le de la respuesta no i am asking to you <laughs> if you can help us but don't worry, <laughs> we will we, we will try. So, Luis, oh, were you in Cuba? In Cuba? No, I wasn't. I am from the Dominican Republic. Really? What the city where you born it? Um, I was born in Santo Domingo. I was born in Santo Domingo. Yes. Were your parents born in Santo Domingo too? No. Yes, they were. We were all yes, born we there. Were. We were all born there. Yes. Uh -huh. And why did you come to the US? And why? I came here to study English. Hmm? Probably, uh -huh. What is it? Wait. I came here to study English. Ah, yeah, yeah. I, I came here to study English, right? What do you think, Juan Francisco? Um, I don't I, listen um, to you. Uh -huh. I, I don't have the picture, and but my you, camera is broke down. 
Can you send it? Oh, okay. My computer don't have uh, office. Ya le dije yo que no tiene que necesitar office para que tenga los documentos. Okay. El archivo que me envió. Si tiene Wait. que solo dice Google Docs y ahí tiene ya office. Wait. Google Docs. Try this. Ponga ahí Google Docs, pero vamos a hacer una pausa en este momento. Ponga Google Docs en la comp. Okay. Google Docs, esto va a buscar. Si yo le mandé el link. No me diga que va a tener otro. Google, Google Docs. Docs. Thank you, Alan. There is. Can you watch watch it? Yes, but give me a moment, Alan. Like uh, okay. Juan Francisco needs to have Google Docs. Ah, Google Docs. Yeah, it's it the really works. Right. Write your best in Google Docs. I feel sleepy. Oh, Wake up. I need to open. Can you share your 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 screen? Again. Juan Francisco. No, Juan Francisco. Ah. Share your screen. Deme un minuto de su vida que este muchacho va a hacer que haga que vaya a Google Docs porque van tres veces que me haciendo lo mismo. Okay. It's not possible. Exactly. You no, can do it. it. Come on. You Comparto su pantalla. Quiero ver. Mm. Why are you watching? <laughs> ¿Cómo puedo hacer eso? What do you watch? No, creo que no vas a ver cómo compartir pantalla. Mm, you are scared to share your. <laughs> Vaya a Google Docs cuando tenga tiempo con su cuenta de Gmail, acceda a Google Docs y ya va a tener Office para trabajar en su computadora. No necesita okay. tener Office pagado. Solo ve en, la, en internet y ya lo tiene. Ok. No me voy a decir mañana que no tiene Google Docs. Ya voy a ver cómo le hago. Mm -hmm. Office 365 too. Or Office 365, no, but Office 365 is for, for companies. Ah, correct. Mm -hmm. Okay. And Google is, is free. Yeah, okay. yeah, you are right. Okay, Con so, continue, continue, continue. Continue. That was the... A commercial. So, a commercial, yeah. Where your parents go and when do you came to know? So, when did you move here? When? We finished. Hello, finish. Let me see the answers. I, okay. I need copy and we practice it too. <laughs> the conversation. <laughs> nice. Let me listen to it. Oh, what are the answers? Uh -huh. <laughs> Anybody? Tell me, tell me, tell me. I'm a Lisa. Okay. Okay, I am this. Okay. Were you, were you born here in the U.S., please? No, I wasn't. I was born in the Caribbean. Caribbean, uh huh. Caribbean. Oh, were you born in Cuba? No, I'm from the Dominican Republic. Really? What city were you born in? I was born in Santo Domingo. Were your parents born in Santo Domingo too? Yes, they were. We were all born there. And why did you come to the U.S.? I came here to study English. So when did you move here? I moved here in... 207. 2007. 2007. 2007. Sorry. Really? How old were you then? I was 16. What is scary? No, it wasn't. I love it. Okay, very good. Those answers are perfect. Perfect, 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 perfect. Thank you. You're welcome. So you two are going to be number one, okay? You're going to share the conversation because the answer is perfect. And we still have two more exercises to do. Yay. <laughs> okay, very good. Okay. I think we, we should go now. Let's call the others. Let's go, let's go.
Hello, hello, hello. Hi, hello. Hi, 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 hello. Now we're going to listen to Esther and Ellington. They are going to give us the answers for this. And we're going to listen to see if we have something different or if we have the same, okay? That's what okay. we're gonna do. <clears throat> okay. But let's, let's wait for the others because I think they are still working. <sighs> yeah. Yeah, mm -hmm. don't don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. <laughs> everything will be everything will be fine. <laughs> <laughs> There's a sound that says that. Yeah. Thank you, Elwin. Okay. You ready? Yes, I'm ready. Yes, okay. So we're gonna have here Estelle and Elinto that are going to share right now we are going to listen to their conversation and let's see if we have something different okay let's just start were you born here in the u.s please no i wasn't i was born in the caribbean oh were you born in cuba no i'm from the dominican republic Really? What city were you born in? I was born in Santo Domingo. Were you currently born in Santo Domingo too? Yes, they were. We were all born there. And why did you come to the U.S.? I came here to study English. So when did you move here? I moved here in 2007. Really? How old were you then? I was 16. Was it scary? Was it scary? No, it wasn't. I loved it. Okay, very good. Give them an applause. Right, very good. Right, remember that we're going to practice and practice conversations so we sound more natural, right? Like for example, we say, was it scary? No, it wasn't, right? So let's see here, one more group. Who wants to participate? Another one? Thank you, Carla Gabriel, for volunteering. Who was your partner? Uh, Veronica and Raúl. Choose one person. Uh, Veronica. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Raúl is very happy. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm Melissa. Okay. Were you born here in the U.S., Luis? No, I wasn't. I was born in the Caribbean. Oh, were you born in Cuba? No, I'm from the Dominican Republic. Really? What city were you born in? I was born in Santo Domingo. Were your parents born in Santo Domingo too? Yes, they were. We were all born there. And why did you come to the U.S.? I came here to study English. So when did you move here? I moved here in 2007. Really? How old were you then? I was 16. What is scary? No, it wasn't. I love it. Okay, very nice, very nice. Give them an applause, very nice, yes. Now, we're going to do one more exercise here. I need you to share. I need you to, oh no. <laughs> I was going to open groups. Let me see here. Can you see my computer, people, right now? 
Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Yes. Okay. yes. We continue talking you with simple past, right? With was and where. So everyone pay attention, right? Because I'm going to ask anybody here right now, right? Mm -hmm. And you're going to tell me the answer. We're going to be selecting the possible answers here for Melissa. It says, Melissa is talking about her family. Choose the correct verb forms, then compare with a partner, right? That's what it says. So we have a paragraph. The first one, we're going to do this together, right? It says here, sorry. my family and I, and then we have two options, was and where. So we select where, right? My family and I were all born in South Korea, right? So that's what we need to pay attention. Now, what is the next answer here? Remember that we are reading sentences, right? What is next, Alan? We? We wasn't, we weren't. We? No. Alan, we, we wasn't? We wasn't born in the U.S. Is that correct, Alan? We wasn't? We weren't. We weren't, very good. We weren't born in the U.S. We weren't born in the U.S. Okay, very good. What about the next one here, uh, Osmin? I? I was, I born. was born in the city of Incheon. Incheon. Okay. I was born in the city of Incheon. Okay, Raul and my brother. My brother and my brother was born and my, there too. And my brother was born there too. Melvin. My parents. My parents. Wasn't born in Incheon. My parents wasn't, wasn't born in Incheon. Is that correct, yeah. Melvin? Think about the answer. In my parents. What subject pronoun is my parents? Is it I, you, she? They. Huh? They. It's they. they. Very good. It's they. they. So what is the answer, Melvin? My they. parents weren't born in Incheon. Weren't. Okay. Weren't <laughs> born in Incheon. Corina. They, they were born in the capital, Seoul. They were born in the capital, Seoul. Okay, very good. In South Korea, Juan Francisco, my father, Juan. Sorry. In South Korea, my father was a businessman. And, and my mother? My mother was a teacher was a teacher okay very good do we understand this exercise yes yes, yes? okay yes. very good clear very good it's clear okay very good let's continue let's continue okay remember that today we have a few more minutes more okay so let's do another exercise together now, no, let me go ahead. Here, let me show you. We're gonna do a small exercise because it's because of the time. Give me one second. Just now, Leo, Laura. Just Laura. Almost, almost. Almost, 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 almost. But I need you to work here with me, okay? Remember that I told you on Monday that we're gonna work a few more minutes, okay? Mm -hmm. More in the class. Now, oops, can you see my computer? No? Not yet. Not yet. No. Not yet, okay, what about now? Yes. Almost, yes. Now. Okay, yes. very good. So I have, I have there some 
pictures, right? Pictures of famous people. We have Frida, we have Jackie Robinson, right? uh, Audrey oh. Hepburn, Bruce Lee, Coco Chanel, and Mark Twain, right? So we have here one example. Based on the information in past tense with these people. For example, this is Frida Kahlo. Melvin, uh, Melvi, can you read the example? Frida Kahlo. Yes. Frida Kahlo was a painter. She was born in 1907 in Mexico. She married painter Diego Rivera in 1929. She died in 1954. Very good. That is one, ex one very simple example about the information that we can see here in the picture about Frida Kahlo. What could be the information about Bruce Lee, Edwin? For example, Bruce Lee? Bruce Lee was uh, an actor uh -huh. and he was born in 19, 1940 uh -huh. in US. He was and born in the US, uh-huh. Uh -huh. He was in he, he was in the movie Enter in Dragon in nineteen seventy three. And he and died. It. And he died mm -hmm. in nineteen seventy three. Nineteen seventy three. Give an applause to Edwin, please. Very good. Very good. That was great. Now, who wants to try with another another character? Maria. Hmm. Mm -hmm. And who is Bruce Lee? I don't know him. Bruce Lee is an actor for like uh, martial arts movies, right? Where they fight. Mm. They fight a lot in those movies. Como Jackie right. Chan. Yeah, he, he was. Uh, Jackie Chan. He was Jackie before Chan. Jackie Chan. Exactly, exactly. He was before Jackie Chan. He was better actually than Jackie Chan. Okay, uh, Maria, Esther, who wants to try? Veronica, Alan. What teacher? Who wants to try? I gave you an example. Edwin gave you another example with Bruce Lee. Let's let's see. Before you go, uh, Coco Chanel. Yeah, go ahead. Great. Okay, Coco Chanel was a fashion designer. Okay. She was born in eighteen. 83 in France in France she opened the first shop in Paris in 1909 1909 1909 uh -huh. she died in 1971 1971 given applause to Maria excellent that was great another person please let the other ones, let's listen to see if we can create also the examples. You should be creating one example right now. Me. ¿Por qué me está manchando la pantalla? Mm. Alan. No. no, I'm not. Sorry, teacher. Okay, Esther. Yeah, Ellington right. is. No. <laughs> nah, you are. You Mire were, Ellen. you were. Uh, Audrey Hepburn was an actress. She was born in 1929. She was in, a, in the movie Breakfast at, at Tiffany in 1961. Mm -hmm. And she died in 1993. Very nice. Very good. That's great. All right. So we have an example here about Audrey Hepburn. Very nice. Great job, Esther. Another person, we're missing Jackie Robinson, and we're missing Mark Twain. Who wants to try with those two? Okay, me. Okay, Alan? Okay. Uh, Jackie Robinson was a baseball, a baseball player. He, he was born in 19, 1990. 19, 1919? 1919. And in U.S. In the U.S., okay. In the U.S., he was the first American, African American, 
guy to play modern major major league baseball in 1947. He died in 1972. 1972. That's great, Alan. Very nice job. Okay. And the last one, who wants to try with Mark Twain? Francisco. I can try. Okay, I'm... Veronica, okay. Or Francisco. <laughs> Veronica, <laughs> yeah, <Francisco. laughs> Okay. <laughs> hey, Vero, hey. <laughs> okay. Uh, only how pronounced Twain? Twain? Wine? <laughs> Mark, Mark Wine? Mark Twain? Twain. 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 Mark Twain. Okay. Mark Twain. Mark That's Twain. Mark Twain. A writer. Ah, a writer. Okay, Mark Twain, Mark Twain was a writer. Okay. He was born in 1835. 1835. Uh, he in US. In the US, okay. In the US, he wrote, wrote The Adventure of How. Huckleberry. Huckleberry Finn. Huckleberry Finn. Finn. In 1885. Yeah. He died in 1910. He died in 1910. Okay, very nice. Very nice. So if you see here, right, we have very small examples. We have the information of a uh, famous person, right? And then we can, you know, use that information to give details. So we can also use the simple past to write a biography, right? So what we're going to do for tomorrow, everyone, 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 you are going to select one famous character or one famous person, right? And you are going to write an example very similar to the ones here. So I need you to take a screenshot so you can remember, right? It's going to be similar to this, right? To the ones that we did. So you can choose, I don't know, Veronica can choose Lady Gaga. <laughs> Pero si no se ha muerto. Que vergüenza. <laughs> right? you, can, you can say, she's singing a song. <laughs> She is not dead, he is not dead. Okay. He is still alive. <laughs> Very good. So do we understand what we're going to do uh, for tomorrow? Yes. Yes. Do you have a question yes. about simple past? No, clear as a chocolate. Clear as chocolate, okay. <laughs> Maria, do you have questions? The question huh? for the exam. Questions for the exam, is there? Teacher, so, yes. sorry, mm -hmm. sorry. solo la vamos a hacer así, digamos, en, en nuestro cuadernito, no en ninguna plataforma. ¿verdad? No, just in the, in the notebook, right? So we can share okay. it here in the class. In the platform, I will put something else, but today I don't know, it wasn't working. Okay, so I don't know. Okay, Veronica, you have something else? Yes, I have a question. Okay, Veronica, please. Yes, okay. So we're going to bring it here for the class, okay? Any questions, Elito, okay. Corina? No? No questions? No. Okay, guys, it's been a pleasure. Hope you have a beautiful day. Thank have a beautiful you. night. You See too. you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Tomorrow at 8 p.m., please, 8 p.m., 8 p.m., 8 p.m., not 8 p.m. Okay, or 8 10. 8 p.m. Okay. 8 p.m. Okay. 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 Corina, please stay, <laughs> so I need to talk to you. No le respondí la pregunta que me hizo. Okay, the other okay, ones can go. Good night. Okay. Bye. Good night. <laughs> bye. Bye. Have a beautiful bye. night. Good dreams. So dreams. Bye bye. Take care. Bye. Take care. Y se fue la Corina, ve. Y le dije que se quedan. No la oigo. ¿Qué? No la oigo, Sandra. Que yo no, que yo tratando de salir, pero se me había como trabado el asunto. Mejor yo, yo me quedé y no ella. Y, no, y le dije, ¿verdad? Que le dije que Gorina que es. ¿Sí? Verdad, <risa> pero quizá quería ir al baño. Bueno. <risa> ok, have a beautiful bye night. Bye. Take care. Bye bye. Thank you. Bye bye. You're welcome. Bye bye. Bye. <risa>